What bird is that? What's up, y'all? We're at the Adams Factory. We are in Thorn, Italy. One of my favorite places to come. The yeah. Adams Factory. Bing. F. Sean. <laughs> Big Kev up with us. What's up? Chilling. Yeah. We got Mill right here. My famous trumpet hey, maker right here. He <laughs> got the Adams pants on. Yeah. Made our dreams come true, man. This is a miracle to have your own trumpet design and come to the factory where they build it. Look how big this place is. This is the factory right here. The Adams Company in the Netherlands. Thorn, the Netherlands. It's so beautiful here. No crime, no violence. Mills live here 40 something years. You've never seen anybody uh, locked up or commit violence. Over here is this big field as far as the eye can see. It's just gorgeous. And I'll take you to the town a little later where we'll go have dinner with little cop streets. It's like a little village. I want to get a house here. It's just beautiful. So let's walk in and see some trumpets. It's going to be slick. It's where they make the Dante Winslow. Winslow Dynasty DWA6 trumpet. Yee. A miracle. Thank you, Mio. Thank you, God. This is the factory. Everything done? Yeah. That's your own trouble back? Huh? That's right here. That looks slick. So walking into the factory, and what do we see? We see a magazine. With me. With Dante Winslow on the cover, look. Wow, cover artist. Winslow Dynasty, into the dynasty. Take one of these with us. This is amazing. It's a miracle. Okay. And look, we have different models by Christian Scott. Bam, bam, bam. That's some amazing architecture there. Hey, nice to meet you. Good to see you. How you doing? Good. This is crazy, man. It's an instrument store here, too, with all kind of mutes and trumpets. Take a look around, and we'll see like a thousand horns. Let's look at the showroom real quick. Let's set this stuff down. What's your name again? I'm Frost. Oh, you are Frost? Yeah, good to yeah, see you. That, that's awesome. Uh, I took a picture last time. Yes, yeah, when we were. On Facebook. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'm gonna look at this. Is this where's the showroom with all of the trumpets? Uh, it's right here. Okay. We're walking through the factory now. Some people have never seen it inside of a huge instrument factory. Well, let me show. Oh, these are just cases. Oh, here's some trumpets right here. It's like a million trumpet cases in here. And uh, these are some of the designs right here. The A9s and the A... You don't see those? Okay. A9, the A1s, A5, DWA6. Amazing, amazing trumpets. It's like an endless row of trumpets. I'm like a trumpet geek, man. Jedi, my son, he has one of these little trumpets. The little tiger trumpets, they're blue, they're cute. They're made out of plastic, but they sound so good. Amazing trumpet cases. Christian Scott poster. Like tubas, euphoniums. Oh, what else would you guys want to see? I mean, there's so much stuff to see here. I'm going to go to the factory, the back, where we see the workers build the instruments because they make them by hand, handmade instruments. And what's amazing about that is here's some of the flugelhorns here. These are the flugelhorns. There's no instruments are made by uh, machines. They're all handcrafted and handmade, which is amazing. So the quality is there and makes it real special. How you doing? Good, good. I'm just excited to be here. I'm a trumpet geek, man. I love instruments. I love craftsmanship and technology. And I think this is amazing. Hey, good hey, to man. see you. How are you? I'm feeling wonderful. Good to see you. 
Okay. Yeah. And his brother is uh, uh, a really good uh, jazz soloist. Oh, wow. Okay. Who's your brother? Okay. Ruud Brugels. Ruud. Got you. Ruud. You know him? Yeah, we like on the uh, email. We hear each other on email. Uh, uh, yeah. So I'm live in the fa- oh. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, everybody? Hi, everybody. We at the factory, look. Everybody sitting down here working. Hi, how you doing? You don't mind being on camera. We just showing kids and the world how you make things by hand. Okay. <laughs> look at the tools everywhere, bells. Hi. Hi, everybody. We in the factory. This is real serious business. This is serious business right here. It's serious business, Mill. Hi. Like he's over here really working on a pile. You see what you're doing there? Buffing a, a water key. Yeah. Water key, okay. He's buffing a water key like this. Good. Awesome. Excellent. And it's like machines with belts spinning and you know, certain parts of the factory. Ah, certain parts of the factory we don't put on camera because they actually have secrets too. And I, is this shining and buffing? He's shining and buffing an uh, instrument right now. Hey. We're in the Netherlands at the Adams factory where they make the instruments. This is amazing for me. Uh, craftsmanship man old school making stuff by hand you know playing instruments analog instruments it's things I just love about life like this is where you give your instrument like in a, a bath and, you know with chemicals it cleans the inside takes everything out strips it this is like the whole factory behind me if you can see this is where all the magic happens guys working putting stuff together by hand here's like a table right here where they build stuff put stuff together here's a table here's a bunch of bells see sometimes the trumpet starts at little pieces and they put them together and they solder it these are a bunch of little trumpet bells and they're so cute they're so cute the trumpet bells just amazing Amazing stuff. Here's a piece of trumpet of a trumpet being built. And these are men like on an assembly line, like the old school. Hey, how you doing? Good. Put parts together on a. That's fire right there, baby. Soldering. Old school craftsmanship. Guys putting hands. How you doing? How are you doing? Actually, good. Carving uh, the top of the finger buttons. Man, people using their real hands to put stuff together. It's just amazing. Into the dynasty. There's another part. It's the whole Adams family up there. Look at that. Keon and Christian. Freddie. Sean. Me. I'm me. The whole wall of great musicians, trumpet players, brass players. Ain't that crazy? That's a slick post. I want to post it like that on my wall. Dynasty boy. Adams Brass. Check us out on the internet, Facebook. Okay. This is Tice. What's up, man? Yeah, man. This hey. is the head of production here. <laughs> He's got a, a little brass lead pipe that they're making for my trumpet. Uh, copper slash red brass lead pipe. Um, these are a bunch of tubes right here. Turn into like tuning slides. <laughs> so, you look at it real close. like tuning slides that you see on the trumpet. My man over here is going straight fire. That's real fire. 
fire right there. That'll burn you to pieces. Get the Adams factory. Real craftsmanship instruments. Real fire here. Like you come in here and just really make instruments. Man drills and things that you put together for making trumpets, brass, euphoniums, tubas, everything. It's an amazing day. I'm in the Netherlands. Dante Winslow, Winslow Donna. Into the dining. Thought while I was here at the factory watching all these people work, man, and banging slave over instruments and do such an amazing job at fine craftsmanship. Hey! Dante, what's your name? Rude. Rude, I was looking for you. Good to see you, man. Thank you. This is Rude, everybody. We talk on the uh, internet all the time. And uh, I'm glad to finally meet you. Oh, my goodness. Um, I was just saying on the camera, it's so amazing to see this many people working. You know, you look throughout the factory, you see everybody putting stuff together. It's getting bigger and bigger. And it's getting bigger, right? And to not be inspired, you know, to play, you feel like stupid. You know, you feel like you really want to practice your instrument and work hard because these people are sitting here working hard so that you have an amazing instrument. So you want to actually put the time in and practice it and try to make something beautiful and magical happen with this piece of metal because men are putting their blood, sweat, and tears to make sure that this metal works properly and sounds beautiful. So that's an interesting thought, you know, when you're playing your instrument. So many people put their sweat, blood, and tears in it. You know, their hard man hours into making an instrument what it is. And so we as musicians put in our time to make art what it is. Just wanted to say that. Love you. I had a great day at the Adam studio today. I had to video this because this is one of my favorite towns to be in. This cobble street and this little town. Ha! You can almost hear yourself like you're in a studio. But it's a little street, man, with these little houses, man, like you in the Shire, like you in the Lord of the Rings, the Hobbits, or the Smurfs or something. It's like these little um, houses in Thorn, Netherlands. We come here after the factory to eat and chill. And the people are so nice and sweet, man. It's only like 2,000 people in the whole city. Never had any crime. Never any violence. And... It's like I could live here and just wake up every day, come out, play my trumpet, you know, read a book. Look, it's quiet. I'm on the streets, and it's, it's like you could whisper. I could say, Tony, Tony, come on. If I was in Baltimore, I'd say, come on up the street, man. We in, we in the Netherlands. I could see myself living far away like that, man. It's like a little Smurf village, but this is the bed and breakfast where we always stay. It's real cute. It's like a little home. And it's beautiful and really chic inside. They're gonna call it on the street. But uh, uh, let's let's meet the owners. And they're so nice. They have great breakfast here too. It's very cute. It's like a full point. It's like a house set up like a hotel. Really, really beautiful. And I like this room right here. I'm with Kevin and Sean. We up in the shire. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. where is Frodo? Right there. Where is Frodo? Shall we find Frodo? The regiment horns, man. Hey. Look, hey, 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 and look at these. Look at the windows. Yo, yeah, it's so nice. Cool. Look at all these books. It's like I'm about to. It's about I'm about to read about something. Oh my goodness, look at this. <laughs> it's like I'm about to read a book and a magical door is gonna open and we're gonna go through and they won't see us in America anymore. <laughs> Yeah, the Chronicles of Narnia. Narnia. Yeah. We're Narnia. 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 This is so cool, though. I love being in foreign countries and uh, checking out cool things. These, these are really cool. Look like little European hats. It's really cool stuff. This staircase is really steep. Never seen a staircase. Almost like a wall. It's like. I'm really great to go to the Hobbit's house. This is so cool. She's bringing some snacks. Into the dynasty. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We appreciate you. Say hi to YouTube. 
We're in your humble abode. Oh, <laughs> hello. Yeah, so your name again? Yolanda. That's Yolanda. And we're in uh, Netherlands. And you're talking we're about... We're in Thorn. Uh, Thorn, yeah. Thorn, Thorn. yes. <laughs> I love it here. I always tell my wife it's one of my favorite places to come. Oh. Um, we just like how the small... It's like a small town. Everyone knows each other. Yeah. Mill said it's like 2,000 people here. 2,500. 2,500 Yeah, people. a bit a bit less, maybe a bit more. So that, that, that depends on uh, who's to going be. to die and who's going to be born. Uh, ah! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> 2,470 uh, and then it's... And then it goes back up again. <laughs> and it goes back up and... Goes back up and <laughs> Into the dynasty. Love y'all. See y'all in a minute. <laughs> Great day. For you, it's over.